Audrey Sakala. I'm coming from Lusaka, SOS area. Um, I came to know about Chromis uh, TV through my friend. Uh, she came here, she was very sick, like she had a partial stroke, the leg and the hand. So my, my auntie had decided to bring her here. So after prayers, uh, she reached here on, uh, on Thursday, I'm sure. On Friday, she attended the meeting. Then she was healed instantly. Then I got marveled because the way the situation was, and because I was there as a witness, I saw what was happening. I was moved. My faith moved me. I said, it said, let me go where my friend got her healing. Then she introduced me to, to Promise TV through YouTube. Because on Facebook, I tried to check, but it wasn't coming. So I went through YouTube. Then I started following the man of God. So I decided to come. So what brought me, I have that spirit of um, whatever I touch, like the spirit of disappointment, whatever I touch doesn't go well with me. Disappointment here and there. Then what I saw from to my friend, I said, if I go there, immediately I step my foot in that place, I know this disappointment will not come with it through sacrament. <laughs> so um, that's the thing. And where I'm coming from, um, my sisters, things are not OK. Everyone has got these own things. Things are not working out for them. And uh, for me, I'm the one who stands. Who stand on, on, on like who, who stand for them? So I said, God, if me I come down or I give up on my faith, what will happen to my family? Because I believe that God uses one to uplift the other. I usually have a critical headache. My headache doesn't stop. So when we, when I came in, I had headache. I thought maybe it was something that I had put on my on my head. I removed it, but it was. I said, God, today is my last day. I don't want to go back with this headache because it doesn't stop until I vomit this headache. What I found here, it's amazing. The power of God is really here. God is working. So some situation you may think that it's the end of you, but without knowing that God has got prepared a place for you. It's not every man of God, I believe, to my side who can deliver you. God has got, each and every one of us has got, uh, we have got our own point in time. And for me coming here, I have faith to say my coming is not in vain. Even those who are watching me, uh, I can just tell you that you ju just come and see for yourself because explaining, just explaining myself, you cannot understand what I found here. Here, this power of God, God is real in this place. God is working. Of if only we have faith in God, you have to have faith for everything to work out for you. It takes faith. Even the Bible, go, Jesus used to tell, uh, whatever he has healed, to say your faith has healed you. So it takes the faith of someone to be healed or to be delivered. So when you come here, come with your faith, believe in God that your life will never be the same. And you see the hand of God upon your life. The way I saw it upon my, my sister, my friend, she was like, we, we even lost hope to say she will never walk again. But what God did through the man of God, it was amazing. She can walk, she can do everything. For that, my faith was boosted. And I believe that my coming here is not in vain. I shall come back to testify because I believe what I've come here, I've gotten it. I don't want just for myself, but I want for my family to see the change. You see the hand of God through me, I'm sure. As I go back, my family will never be the same. This headache doesn't stop until I vomit, but I don't know how it went. It just disappeared like that. I'm okay right now. I can't feel it, and I believe it has gone. 
it will never come back. There are a lot happening. I knew God a long time ago. Uh, but sometimes you find in life, the more you pray for something, things doesn't happen. Then you tend to give up to say, is God really on my side? Does God hear my, my situation? What is it that is happening to me? But what I saw, like what I saw, what happened to my friend, because she's a person I pray with, she's a person who encouraged me. So the time she got, uh, she got attacked, like when she, was, she had that stroke, I started asking God to say, God, if the, the woman of God, the person who, who loves you, who do the work of God, can be attacked like this, what about me? Then a lot of things start coming in, into my mind to say, what if something happened to her? What would be of me? Because, like, she's the person who encouraged me. But uh, I learned something to say. Like, when I went to the Bible, there's a man who was born blind. Then somebody asked to say, who, say, who sinned between the mother and the father for, that, for this one to be born like this? said, this person was born like this for the glory of God to be seen. So sometimes it takes time. We can be praying, but if it's not our time, we may see that, no, maybe God is not waking or is not answering my prayers. But when your time comes, surely God answers and he hears. Viewers all over the world, I say, this is a place of solution. Like I said that first, just come here with your faith. Believe in God for a change upon your life and you will see it. You may go to a lot of prayers or prayer houses. You haven't seen change. But I promise you, if you just come here and ha come with your faith, I, be, I know you testify. Because me, I believe that I'm coming back with my testimony. You testify. Just come. Trust God. Believe in God. Come here. You'll see the hand of God upon your life. I've seen a lot of things when the service was going through. A lot of miracles people being healed, people being delivered. And I know when you come here as well, your life will never be the same.